Hello everyone and I hope you're having a great day. Um, I never thought I would make this video but this is actually very concerning for me and, and should concern for every YouTuber on the platform because if you haven't heard the controversy with Sniper Wolf, um, this is actually very serious and it affects all content creators. So basically, um, in case you don't know what happened, uh, about a couple of days ago, uh, Sniper Wolf doxed uh, an, a YouTuber named Jax Films. Jax Films content is known to be heavily critical of Sniper Wolf's content, and rightfully so, because Sniper Wolf's uh, videos were all stolen from other creators' uh, work. To be honest, though, Sniper Wolf has never been a good YouTuber, to be honest. But she has put herself in hot water now because, like I said before, she has doxxed a YouTube creator, House Address. And this is actually very concerning. As a matter of fact, it's quite scary, to be honest, because YouTube never done anything about this. They just pretended that it never happened. Now, according to YouTube's terms of service, doxxing is a permanent ban. Like, you could just look it up straight away. Hopefully YouTube doesn't change it, as they will very soon. Now, just to clarify, YouTube has a doxer on their platform, and they are doing absolutely nothing about it. Now, I believe it's mostly about money, because Sniper Wolf has about 34 million subscribers, and she, along with YouTube, are making a lot of money. Now, just recently, YouTube has managed to take action against Sniper Wolf, but this was a very, very soft punishment because all they did was demonetize her channel. Temporary. That means that she will be monetized again later on. What's even more weird is that Sniper Wolf has uh, posted an apology video at the exact same time as YouTube uh, posted their confirmation that Sniper Wolf has been demonetized. It's very, very strange. And it's not surprising to say the least, because her apology just seems obviously fake. As a matter of fact, it's been confirmed to be fake, as people managed to find out that she's using ChatGPT uh, to write an apology tweet. And it is obviously uh, pathetic, absolutely pathetic. But what can you expect from Sniper Wolf? Anyways, I think that's all I have to say here. But the point I was making in this video is that YouTube is protecting a doxer on their platform. And they have done absolutely fuck all to do about it. Much less they just demonetize her channel and just pretend that nothing ever happened. That was it. They just went tone deaf. Regardless of it all, YouTube has shown themselves to have a double standard. They only protect those who make them the most money. It doesn't matter if they are a criminal or not. If you are making YouTube more money on their platform, you are safe under their wing. It's only a matter of time until many YouTubers will move to Rumble, which is a free speech platform. But anyways, that's all I gotta say for today's video. If you like this video, give it a like. And if you dislike this video, give it a dislike. I appreciate all feedbacks given. Thank you, everyone. And God bless you all. Oh, and by the way, doxing is illegal in California. So Sniper Wolf should have been arrested uh, a couple days ago. And I'm still wondering why she hasn't yet.